David appears to have brought closure to the unfortunate highwayman Robert Dubois. But had he found the light? Carl and Stuart returned to the attic of the Black Horse, supposed scene of devil worship and witchcraft. Would their continued investigation there reveal the murderer, John Michaels, or unleash other demons? Right, I think we need to be a bit calm on this one now, don't we, Carl? Are you not hot? I am hot up here, yeah. I don't know why, because there's no, there's no central heating on up here. Um, I don't know. Might be because we've been running around so much. It's supposed to be devil worship back now, up here. And what are we going to do about that then? Well, it's f are we going to call out and do? Come and f do something. It sounds like someone's coming up the stairs. Come on, please do something for us. Oh, Carl! No, 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 no! Make sure there's somebody. There's no one next door. Make sure get no. Stay calm, stay calm. Stay calm, stay calm. Stay calm. Stay calm. Whoa! Don't do that, don't do that. What? What? Something just brushed across my face. Carl. I'm going. F you. F all of you, I'm off. Come on. Oh, Jeez. satisfied with the outcome of the Pluckley investigation. It would seem that the Most Haunted team have finally resolved the mystery of the murder of highwayman Robert Dubois, whose death was brought about by a combination of his crimes and perhaps more tellingly his meddling in the romance between his sister and his eventual murderer John Michaels. David attempted to send Robert towards the light but was uncertain that he'd been able to help the highwayman. David returned to the Black Horse pub to offer final rest to his killer, John. Before me, Raphael. Behind me, Gabriel. But despite all his efforts, something evil still remains at the pub. Well, that's it for another Most Haunted Midsummer Murders. So, did we solve the mystery surrounding Pluckley, or did we just create more questions? That's for you to decide. Until next week, sleep tight. Pluckley sounded so nice and innocent, didn't it? More of our country's rural evil past back same time next week on Living. But if you want more now, flick over to Living 2 as we continue with Most Haunted Midsummer Murders Extra.